did medieval Christians believe in a flat earth? No, but the story is quite useful for making Christians look stupid because Christianity was the dominant social force at the time. Here's another way we could pose the question. Were you taught in school that religion-induced ignorance made Europeans think Earth was flat until Columbus came around in 1492 who showed otherwise? That's actually a myth. The truth is there were many great arguments for a spherical Earth before 1492, and they were taught in the university a Christian invention. Consider this argument. Here we have our planet, its North Pole, and the equator. Medieval Christians understood that if one were to stand on the North Pole and look directly overhead, you would see the North Star. That's why it's called the North Star. If you were to stand on the equator, you would have to look along your horizon or on your horizon to see that same star in the sky. Between the equator and the pole, there are a range of angles that you would have to look up from your horizon to see Polaris. And this proves that the Earth has at least a north-south curvature. Medieval university students could make this argument effectively for a spherical Earth, but many of us today have no idea that this proves the Earth is curved. Over many years of teaching astronomy, I've had my students role play two different viewpoints, the flat Earth viewpoint and the round Earth viewpoint, and make arguments for each side. And it's surprising that many students today have a hard time arguing for a spherical Earth, but can pull out the usual arguments for a flat Earth. Well, it looks flat, right? And things like that. Well, it turns out that medieval students could make a much better argument for a spherical Earth than many students today. So maybe they weren't that ignorant after all. <laughs>